Bienvenidas y bienvenidos a otro episodio de Get It Girl. On today's show, we have Jessica Rose joining us to talk about non-toxic beauty and women's health. And on the couch today, we have energy healer, the mommy goddess, and chef, and foodie, Tati Polo. So don't go anywhere. Because Get It Girl is about to start. She's a holistic nutritionist and a natural beauty expert and a licensed co cosmetologist. Please welcome Jessica Rose. Hi, how are you? Good, thank you for having me. Thanks for coming. So how does it play with the natural ingredients that we're putting on the exterior part of our body? Sure, so it's been estimated that the average woman uses 168 toxins on her skin daily. Wow. And that's estimated from our skincare, our makeup, our hair care, our body products and they're absorbed through our largest organ, which is our skin, and then they can go straight into our bloodstream. And then that can cause a lot of chronic illness and different health issues, so my job is just to empower women and to help them to feel good in their skin and just help to use mm -hmm. natural products that really just increase their health and their beauty in just like a really natural way. So where do we get the toxins from? Makeup has a lot of different things. The top ingredients I would say to avoid are like talcs, petroleums, uh, formaldehydes. A lot of the ingredients in makeup and skincare cause a lot of estrogen and hormonal issues in women, so it's just really nice to take a look at it. I teach women how to look at the ingredient label and just reduce everything that they're using every day. I love it because you know we learn more and more about nutrition labels exactly. and it's amazing you're doing this now with the beauty field. I actually didn't even know that beauty products affect our hormones. Yes. What are the, the negative effects that it can do to our hormones? So it's been found out that talc which is in a lot of beauty products have been they're kind of being taken out now but they cause ovarian cancer, they can cause oh, breast cancer. Serious? Yes. Wow. So, we know we've been led to believe that what's on the shelf is safe for us. We look at it, it says natural, or it's, yeah, you know, it's on the shelf, yeah. so somebody's regulating it, but it's not. And so the FDA is actually, um, the beauty industry is not regulated whatsoever. How do you know that it's all natural, for example? So it's a lot of research. There's toluene, there's something called phenyl, exoethanol, which is kind of hard to say, uh -huh. but it's in a lot of mascaras. I was using a mascara that had that, and I had to take that back and use something different, but. There's a long list. I created a, what's it called, a non-toxic beauty guide. Mm -hmm. So women, oh, that's so oh. helpful. Where can they find that? Yeah. That's on my website, uh, Jessica Rose Nutrition or JessicaRoseWellness.com. Perfect. Oh my God, we got to take that yeah. note too. So the ingredients that we do want to look for. What are natural beauty products made of, though? So, is it made of a flu like foods, herbs, spices? You know, what is it? Uh, so there's a brand I love. It's called 100% Pure. That's my favorite brand. It's made. That's out easy of, to remember too. Yeah, 100% Pure. 100%, yeah. So remember that. It's made out of fruit pigments and essential oils. Uh, she started out in Napa and she literally takes it from raspberries and blueberries and strawberries. Mm. So the lipstick I'm wearing today is made from blueberries and raspberries and what? strawberries. Oh, really? That's amazing. But, uh, it doesn't have any preservatives at all? Or? Um, they can get away with using things like rosemary or just some type of natural preservative, mm. but it's not actually something that will influence your health in a bad way. And I feel like that's also with aging skin. I personally don't wear makeup every day unless I'm yes. on yeah. set. Yeah. I love to just go with like a coconut oil yeah. and like I just, it really does, it has preserved my skin mm -hmm. and I mean what are the natural uh, oils that you like to use is there coconut oil do you like a lot of coconut oil base uh, I don't like coconut oil I found it's called non comnogenic I've heard uh, that where it like it'll break me out it, oh it breaks oh, you out see yeah. for me it doesn't break me out no. but I've heard that for some it like clogs their pores yeah. mm -hmm. no, your so what are clogs. other oh thank you <laughs> I do a lot of laser facials too though girls it's so, <laughs> I mean just like you know just like fitness your wellness as you know it's so much uh, consistency it's yeah. so much, it's a lifestyle yeah. right it really does become a lifestyle what is your lifestyle look like? Um, I do beauty from within. Everything is holistic, so I eat well. What I put into my mouth also reflects how I look on the outside. So it's all natural foods that like really empower women to just look good, feel good, and it's just everything is just natural. Oh my God, girl, we gotta team up because I've been doing. I definitely talk about eating right to feel great, so that you're able exactly. to exercise, so that you're not you don't have to take all the caffeine things that you have to do. Your body can create mm. all this amazing energy just by moving yeah. your body, putting on a song, and dancing. So, for up. example, what are the basic foods? to improve your health, for example. I say everyone should start with bone broth if you love bone broth. Oh, mm -hmm. I love bone that. Okay. Really, yeah. So I'm all about digestive health. Uh, your health originates in the gut. So yes. bone broth really helps to help to improve your gut, your hair, your skin and nails. It's full of collagen. 
Mm. And so every day I like to eat these little lemon gummy chews I made. They're made out of collagen. Yeah, I saw that on your Instagram. Yeah, I, I was. I was just like, give me that. Yes. So I'm just popping collagen. I'm like, hey, I'm improving my skin and I'm yes. improving my health at the same time. Yes, exactly. And 80% of your serotonin is created in your gut. Exactly. Which is not only does it make us beautiful, but it makes us happy, you guys. Exactly. People are always like, Gia, how are you always so happy? I literally focus so much on the gut health. I do oh a lot of God. apple cider vinegar as well, mm. which is supposed to also help tighten your skin is what I've heard too. Because yeah. yeah. of the health gut or the the healthiness in your gut as well i love mm -hmm. this i feel like we could talk forever i know <laughs> i know seriously so a lot of the information though they could find for these guides on your website yes. at um it was jessica rose wellness.com and then your instagram would also be jessica rose wellness okay. and then all social platforms as well Oh my god, we have to stalk her because I yes. need more information. I'm because I mean, already. for fitness, there's you know obviously there's there's some fruits, everything's you know with antioxidants, foods exactly. that are healthy and proteins. But you never know, like food also can make us beautiful, you guys. That's my favorite thing. It's, it's amazing. Well, thank you, Jessica, so much thank for you. joining us. We have learned a lot, but we're running out of time. Don't go anywhere because we'll be right back with more Get It Girl. She is an energy healer, a soul coach, and many more things. Please welcome Cindy Kanek. Ooh. Did I say that right? Yes, Kanek. Okay. Oh <laughs> welcome. Thank you. Thanks for coming. How are you? How are you? You are like a major boss babe. You have yeah. like all these businesses. Tell, Tell us about us, yeah. that. How do you do it? <laughs> uh, passion, energy, source. Source. Mm. Yeah. Yes. I'm a huge believer that when you're aligning your purpose, you have the infinite like abundance of energy to do what you're meant to do. Yes. So that's kind of where that's how that's where I get my my drive. And how do you feel it? Mm. What is your real your realization that it's like no, this is what I am supposed to do. For me, it's been a journey. It's a journey. You know what I mean? I can't. You can't just like walk up one day and say, okay, I'm gonna be this. You know? Yeah. It's just it's it's a day by day process. And I started you know Cindy Canick, aka the Mommy mm -hmm. Goddess, after I got divorced and all of that and. Through that transition, I realized that I had to go back to my roots, which was my gift, my don, which is mm -hmm. like, I'm an energy healer mm -hmm. this year. Um, and it all comes through like, you know, my grandma, my great grandma. So through that, as the more that I get it, that I got closer to myself, the more that I just got it, like these little voices, like do this, do this, yeah. do this. That spirit guide, right? right? Just, exactly. Yeah. Yes. I, say, I say spirit's my homie. Yes. <laughs> And I love that you did it also after a divorce. I mean, people always are like, divorce yeah. is so difficult. I started my business after my divorce too. And mm -hmm. I look at now my divorce is the best gift of all. It's like, thank you for all the pain. <laughs> yes. Because it, really, the because it really puts you into like, I, I've gone into cocoon, you know, you get yeah, so you depressed and you're just like in this dark yeah. space. And as much as, you know, I look back at it and it was like, it was so hard. I was like, I but needed it to fire. Yes. It's telling it's you, come on, move on. your booty yeah. that, you need yes. to do, that you need to have sometimes to push through it, right? Yes. So yes. how did you come up with mommy goddess? Um, oh God, it's a long story, but I'll give you the nutshell version because um, when I was right about when I was going to make that decision, I'm going to get a divorce. I remember I was super like, you know, depressed and all of that. And I seeked out a spiritual coach. You know, I Googled it. I was like, wow. spiritual coach. And I found um, Shiro, which if you... Uh, if Shiro, you, Ooh, Shiro. I like that. Oh my God, if you guys ever, I'll put them... I'll tag him and he's lo que no piensan. What do you guys don't even think? He's wow. an Asian guy in his 50s. Oh my okay. God. Right? Hey, those Asian guys, they have, you know, they're <laughs> an old, the oldest country there is. There's probably wisdom that we don't even have. Yet. Yes, but he doesn't look like a, a spiritual coach. So I walk in to, you know, meet him and he's like, you already know what you're supposed to do. You're already going to get divorced. He told me. I was like, oh. <gasps> You didn't even tell anything, anything. no like, background like, thing. That why you came here, you already know. Wow. And then he's like, it's hard to make that decision to get divorced, especially Latino cultures. I mean, mm. my mom endured 40 years of awfulness. Yeah. And it's like, you just think you're supposed to do that, but something inside yeah. you is like, mm -mm. it's the mentality of just stick to it, mm -hmm. stick to it. Yes. Like for the kids, yeah. for, yeah. Yes. Wow. So that's so. how he, I walk in and he's like, starts telling me, this was like four years ago. He's like, you need to do something. You, you have something in your mind. He's like, you're going to be big. He's like, you're going to be like, you're going to write a book. And I'm like, sitting there, I'm like, I'm fucking depressed. Excuse me. I'm <laughs> depressed. And I could barely like get out of bed. So yeah. you're telling me like I have something to do. Right. And that's how he, that's how the name came. Cause I already had the name, like the mommy goddess. It was like spirit. It was that mm. voice telling yes. me that I was supposed to start the blog. Yeah. And that's how I started. I started through writing. 
And if you take the time, you know, a lot of women go from one relationship to the next. If you really take the time to be alone and silence the voices, you can really hear. And it gets mm -hmm. louder and louder mm -hmm. and louder, you yeah. know? So yeah. what other projects do you have now? So uh, just, again, I feel so blessed, like just even being here, you know, like oh, how everything oh just God, keeps happening here. Yes. Presents, girl. <laughs> everything just happened. It's like, I just follow the flow of life. Yeah. And uh, right now I have a lot of things. I'm doing a lot of uh, speaking engagements. Um, I'm doing, I, I'm a healer. I'm a natural healer. I love people. My whole platform is connection. Yeah. Mm. Like that's why I started my platform because when I was going through what I was going through, I needed connection yeah. and deep healing yes. share yes. with other people. Yes. And okay, so that's, that's why cool. I start like the mommy goddess is my main business is healing. So mm. I see people with the severe trauma and I help them transform their lives. Um, and I'm just doing pop-ups like next week I actually have, it's called spirit led series literally yesterday out of nowhere. Whoever wants to come donation base free. I got like a warehouse wow. and I'm just going to see people that need, Help. Oh wow. my God, I need to sign up for that. <laughs> because you can never get enough healing. I feel yeah. like, like yeah. you said, healing is a journey. Yeah. And are there products involved as well? I know with some of them, the oh. magic beep. <laughs> the magical, <laughs> I know, because the magic B word. Right? The, <laughs> the magic B, B word, word, exactly. What, are there any products? Like, what do you believe in as far as products? I know a lot of things I'm sure is more spirit-based, mm -hmm. but is there any things that you anchor? that you use to anchor yourself? Uh, as far as like my day-to-day -day life? Uh, no, for the, the, for, the, oh, for my the products? business. Okay, so yeah. my products, I have I have two businesses. I mean, I have like four, but the ones yeah. that are kind of active right now is mm -hmm. obviously my healing services. And then the Magical Bee <laughs> <laughs> is all, I, they call, I call them magic products. It's all stuff that I make myself and mm. it's candles and it's all set with intention. So oh, candles wow. are scary though. Yes, I try to love spell. That works yes. and not in a good way, yes. you guys. I don't do that. No, I was going to ask I you, do, do you believe in that? Because it's like, like Santeria. I yeah, I don't do that. It's really bad. <laughs> I believe in magic and it's very powerful. It's pero so eso yo, I do not do that. Pero eso no. I, I, didn't, know. I didn't believe in magic and I did it thinking it was just a prayer candle and no, that like really works. Karma. And we have Latinas, we have brujas for generations and generations yes. and generations. Yes. So a great, great, it is, yeah. yeah, it's definitely, you don't want to play with magic, you guys. Do not do that. <laughs> <laughs> I only work with light. That's all I do. Yeah. I right. work with light. That's yes, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Well, Cindy, unfortunately, we're running out of time, Thank but you. we want you back for sure so we'll be right back with more get it girl And we are back on Get It Girl with a very special guest, una amiga cercana. She is a former Venezuelan beauty pageant contestant, a synchronized swimmer, model, and currently a very successful chef. Ooh. Please welcome Tati <laughs> Polo. Thank you, ladies. <laughs> Thank you, Angelita. Oh Thank you, Dia, for having me here. I'm so thrilled. Oh my this is God. so exciting. Yes. I love the I whole know. Thing. Girl talk, yes. girl talk. Yes. We want to yes. know. Yes. We want to know just how did you come up with these like amazing salads? And I love your saying, yes. one salad a day keeps the lonjas away. Well, as you know, <laughs> yes, oh and it does, it does. It does. If you really think oh, about it, it unless you have like 10 hamburgers after that. I know. But you know what? <laughs> Keep it clean. <laughs> Keep it clean. Anyway. Yeah, well, I, I came from Le Cordon Bleu. I graduated like 10 years ago. Oh, yeah. Um, yes. Uh, and I just made the decision. It just happened. I, I said, how can I make something different, right? Mm -hmm. And something that it can actually help our community. Community, the yes. Latino community. Mm, we don't know how to eat a salad. It's like we think Puro about taco. salads, <laughs> and what do you think? It's like lettuce, mm, yes, tomatoes, and that's thing, stinky onions. And that's the thing people think that tomatoes. that's healthy though. A salad. I love that your salads mm -hmm. actually incorporate quinoa, couscous, Thank like you. things like that. Because Fusion. also when people are like, I'm not losing weight, but I'm eating a salad. I'm mm -hmm. like, you're just eating lettuce. Oh, that they're is making nothing a huge mistake with the dressing. With the dressings. There you go. Sugar yeah. dressing, like or mayonnaise. Exactly. exactly. Because they want the flavor. Huh? Exactly. But we're going to learn how to make a dressing okay. today. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I created a concept called Sala Land, Una Ensalada al Día, Te Cambiará la Vida. I'm super excited about being sharing a salad a day on my social media. Chef Tati Polo, if you don't know that. Yes. But, um, and it's just amazing. I, I love helping people. I love, you know, like empowering women as well. Cooking, like doing cooking classes, enseñándoles, you know, like sí. little tips that we don't know. Mm, like sí, I sí. didn't know when I got to this country that fat free. I mean, the only English I knew 
it was, hola, hello, how are you? And I was like, shit, don't ask me anything else. <laughs> <laughs> yes, because the marketing, I, fat free really is not healthy. Yeah. They take the fat out, but they actually substitute it with, with sugars. Other, yeah. With sugars, My which game, turns into 40 fat. pounds. Like, look at me now with 40 pounds. <gasps> and I was like, what am I doing, Ron? Yes, it says yogurt fat free, and I'm like, oh, mm, yes. so amazing, <laughs> yeah. it's fat free. And oh, it like, no. tastes so good, though. It's so uh -huh. sweet. Mm -hmm. We don't realize mm -hmm. that sugar turns into fat, though. Yeah, That's the most of important sugar. thing. There's a lot of sugar in no. the food, especially here in the mm -hmm. States. It's especially like, here. And it not yeah. necessarily says sugar. It'll say, like, sucralose or high fructose, uh -huh. you know, things like that. There's tricky words that marketing can use, and not everything is regulated. That is know? why I always, like, tell them, like, just read the labels. It might say a hundred, you know, a hundred percent organic, and but then it doesn't, it says blend. Don't yeah. Blend. yeah. I love but then it's not like real coconut oil, you know, yes. it's a blend. It's like coconut oil plus maybe like flaxseed oil or something else, yeah, like corn vegetable oil. oil. Corn, mm -hmm. yes. which is corn so is, bad. Yeah. It's very, mm -hmm. it's used because it's very cheap to make. Exactly, mm -hmm. that's yeah. why I like avocado oil. Uh, I, I use it for my skin sense. too. Yes. Yes. I use coconut oil everywhere. Yeah. Like oh, everywhere. So everywhere. everywhere. Girl, everywhere. everywhere. Ocasión. Ocasión. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Try it. You'll love it. And we just learned today, Your too. Your boyfriend will take right. you for it. <laughs> but the flavor. And we learned you know? today, too, that all the foods that we put in our body also create our yeah. beauty. Yeah. You know the saying, you are what you eat? Mm -hmm. You literally oh, are what, what you, you eat. eat. Your cells, everything mm -hmm. turns into the things that your body is processing. And the energy labels. Like, yes. energy labels. Like, why are people so, like, unhappy? Like, avocados, they make you so happy. Like, if you yes. eat the right thing, Things, then you have fuel. Then you're exactly. like energetic, exactly. right? Yeah, and you feel it's, happier. It's so true. And mm. you know that. Like, I mean, I get asked mm. this all the time. I'm sure you do. They're like, how are you always so happy and energetic? I Not that, that I don't have my days, you know, period days. Oh, you yes. know, girl, don't and get near me sometimes. I'm very strong. But, I'm, yes, really, I'm happy, happy too. <laughs> that's the food. And that's the food too. Yes, right? yes it, it is it. the food. I mean, especially during it that time. It makes you passionate. It makes you passionate. Oh, yes. Hormones. Yes. yes. But as we know, like, good food gives us good energy. Bad food gives us really mm -hmm. bad energy, yes. right? Mm -hmm. Just like that. So start eating healthier and you're gonna start noticing the, I the, know. the changes yeah. in I you, know. in your moods. Like you can concentrate better. Like take like herbal supplements. They're mm -hmm. amazing, you know? Yeah. So but every a, day. But yeah. a lot of us know, you know, a lot of people watching, they're like, I know you gotta eat vegetables, but mm -hmm. why, what was your why? To, you know, help somebody else understand why really should we eat? Because good. everybody should, like will ask me like, how do you, like, how do you, like keep it like so thin and how are you so happy all the time and how much energy like you can give to everything you do mm -hmm. and i'm like i believe that i eat salads and and, and i really believe in that so, so you eat only salads like no, every day no, like, one salad that? a day just to take the long huh? wait yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah but even yeah. your salads include like i said like whole meal. Foods, like yeah, it's yeah, a yeah, whole yeah. meal quinoa and veggies yeah. and and fruits and yeah. seeds yeah. and nuts everything you want yeah do you yes. do protein so you do add some protein like so salmon I and chicken so i only eat like fish salmon and seafood but other Tuna. than that yes yeah. other than that i don't eat chicken or red meats anymore no. yeah wow. the only red meat i eat i'll tell you later because oh. we have to take a quick break <laughs> but we'll be <laughs> right back with more fat <laughs> Ya estamos de vuelta y seguimos con Tati Polo porque tiene mucho que contarnos. Oh. Mucho que cocinar. Sí. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? ¿Qué vamos, vamos a, hacer? a preparar una ensalada. Yes. <laughs> Pero no una aburrida. This is not going to no. be a boring salad. This is going to be a rich, nutrient yes. salad. And don't complicate yourself. Just get a bunch of fruits and like, like mixed greens, spinach, whatever you like. Get a lot, and then you just put a salad together for you in okay. five minutes. Let's see if we can make this in three. Okay, okay. all right. Wow. Okay, we got okay. a bowl, right? All right, yes. what do we Beautiful. need? Beautiful, we're gonna go right. mix greens today. You greens. can use arugula, you can use spinach at home. Okay, then we're gonna add the ingredients for the salad, which we have here is corn, 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 corn. Okay. Corn, beautiful. If you use like the corn can, please wash it. Okay, better the fresh. And this is a serving size onions. for one or two people. What do two you think? Two people. For two people. Two people. Okay. And then we're gonna add our onions. If we wanna get rid of the like very strong taste of the onion, what do you do? I don't water. know. Soak it in water for five minutes, really, really 
cold and water. water. And that's okay. it. You can eat onions. Okay. Oh my God. Already strawberries. Strawberries. Oh, I love Which it. Which is like yes. carbohydrates. Just put this in is here. The, the good energy mm -hmm. that you need. Okay. Salads can have fruits. Eat a mummy, which are like load of protein. Yes. Okay. And then we're gonna add. Anti, anti, how do you say that? Antioxidants. 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 Yes, I said it. Blueberry. See? Oh, I love the colors delicious. already. The colors and then that you're gonna throw tomatoes. If you want to get the best out of tomatoes, you always cook them, but they're amazing for salads. We love it. It's a fruit at the end, right? Oh my gosh. Look it's at this. Wow, this is so yeah. beautiful. Colors. That's it. It takes us nothing. And then you can add quinoa. You can add like brown rice. You can add salmon. Amaranth. You can add salmon, chicken, right? Anything Another you want. protein. Yeah. Yes. Mix what it about up. The avocado. Blah, blah, blah. The avocado, ah. which is an amazing fat for us. We're gonna do the dressing. So get your hands dirty, open it up. So instead of using so much fat, like olive oil, or we're gonna use the fat of the avocado. But and just olive oil is good too, though, right? To do dressings it too, is. right? For dressings, it's better for like when you're like, like cooking, no cooking right? it. Yeah. Okay. No cooking no. it because it loses the benefits. So okay. there you go. We're gonna start with an avocado, and this dressing, by the way, you can add it to any salad you want, wow. okay? So we're gonna add some salt and pepper. So okay. we always, with dressings, so you want sprinkles. something that is- You have to do the I uh, yes. <laughs> something that is sad, something that is sweet, something that is acid. That way, you know, your tongue it goes like on ecstasy uh, and on orgasm. So this is the dressing. This one's the uh, uh, apple cider vinegar? <laughs> Haven't you ever had an orgasm with food? I oh, have. Course, yeah. Okay, good. That was apple cider vinegar? Was that apple huh? cider vinegar? Yes. Okay, that was apple cider and vinegar. And you can use lemon juice, you can use orange juice. Just any, something acidic. Something acidic. Mm -hmm. okay. And then we're going to add a little bit of maple syrup. But okay. what can you do instead of maple syrup? Um, honey, 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 yes. Mm -hmm. You can do agave. 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 Yes. Okay. Get a girl. Get a girl. Get a girl. Olive eh? oil, or you can use avocado oil, or you can use also like any nuts oil, which is like uh, delicious, like flaxseed oil. Or, okay. Yes. And then what do we do? Like we just blend it. We blend it. And we <laughs> add it to our salads, and we take that long hair away. Yes. Oh my God, I love wow. it. Yes. And just it has all the nutrients. It has the protein. Mm -hmm. It has the carbohydrates. It has the fat which is what our body needs in order to produce better energy. Exactly. Mm. And to this dressing, ladies, if you want, you can add strawberries, you can add blueberries, and just make a whole new different dressing. Wow. Yes. Yeah. I know. Pues esperemos oh. que aprendieron algo, Tati. Qué pena. Ay, Ay, se nos acabó el tiempo. Gracias, mi amor. ¿Dónde te pueden seguir entonces? Oh, chef Tati Polo con la I de puntito. Ahí está. Ya lo han oído. <laughs> and guys, don't forget to follow us on Get It Girl TV mm -hmm. and LA TV Network. We'll see you next time.